Hi everyone, my name is Mike Mello, Broker Associate and owner at Preferred Real Estate Brokers. Today we're in Port St. Lucie, Florida in a community called Astor Creek Golf and Country Club. We're about to show you this home behind us is a two bedroom, two bathroom home with 1,968 square feet of living. The base price at time of filming is 506,990. So come ahead and follow me. Let's go ahead and see what we have. We have the paved driveway coming up to a two car garage. Really nice tropical landscaping all around as we continue around the paved walkway. We come to the front entry with the really nice high ceilings, really beautiful elevation of the home and in front of us a door. So let's go ahead and go inside and check out this home. All right, so welcome into this home. So as soon as I walk into the home, I notice these huge porcelain tiles that go throughout the home. And then of course, over to my left is this accent wall done in gray, a couple light fixtures on either side, mirror going all the way up. This is an example of something that you'd have to do after the fact. And as we continue to look up, we have the really, really high ceilings with a tray ceiling and then you have a floating ceiling coming down with some backlight behind it and wallpaper. It's absolutely beautiful with the light fixture coming down from the center. So over to my right, it's gonna be bedroom number two and the flex space. We'll talk to you about that a little bit later on in the video. But first of all, let's go ahead and go to our main living area where we have our kitchen, we have the family room and we have our dining area. So let's talk about the kitchen first. So as I come over to the kitchen, the first thing we have is the center island. Center island has the waterfall countertops, beautiful, beautiful uh, countertops here with the four seats, three light fixtures above us. And as we continue to come over to the kitchen, we see we have all these white cabinets with the display cabinets going all the way through. We have a stove top right in front of us. This is an electric community with the air vents. Over on the other side, we have a dishwasher, the sink, and this one does have a little bit different color. So we have that light, light brown color on the center island that contrasts well with the white on the other side. As we continue through to the kitchen, we have our refrigerators, a GE refrigerator freezer in front of us. And over to the left, we have a GE oven and microwave. So everything you need for this specific home. And then through this door is the pantry. So as you come into the pantry, the pantry is done really nice. They have all these really nice custom built-in shelves with soft clothes, uh, solid surface uh, uh, countertops, and the really nice backsplash that goes all the way through shelving and even some extra uh, uh, cabinet space above us. So anyway, let's go ahead and show you the dining room, which is right across here. So as I come into the dining room, it's currently set up for eight people to sit around and enjoy a nice dinner. Uh, we have the accent wall behind me, some windows for some natural light. And then as I look up, we have this really cool chandelier. The chandelier is on the ceiling with the really beautiful woodworking going all the way across to the family room with the twin chandelier in the family room. Family room is a good size family room with the couch, couple chairs. We have the accent wall that matches the dining room accent wall where we have the TV on, some floating shelves and floating cabinets. We have even lights underneath the cabinets. So pretty beautiful design. Behind me is sliding glass door going out to the outdoor living area with a really, really cool pool. We'll show you that later on in the video. But first of all, let's go ahead and go over to the primary suite, which is just through this door. As we come into the primary suite, the flooring changes to this light wood color. We have the king size bed, couple end tables on your side, and uh, and then the accent wall behind in sort of that the the blue color, bluish gray color with the antique glass on either side or antique mirror on either side. We have a light fixture that comes down from the ceiling and the ceiling itself is a tray ceiling with some woodworking and wallpaper in it. It sort of looks like a coffer ceiling, but it isn't. And then on the far side, we do have the windows looking out onto the pool area and the golf course. So really, really nice window with the extra pane of glass above it. So let's go ahead and go to the right where we go into the primary bathroom. We have the porcelain tiles here in the bathroom. Over on the left, we have the dual sinks with the gray cabinet, solid surface countertops, mirror that's framed in gray and a couple light fixtures coming out. Above the mirror, we have a window for some natural light. And on the other side of the uh, bathroom. We do have our shower. The shower has the frameless glass, which is the really nice thick glass. Uh, we have the hexagon tiles in beige on the floor and porcelain tiles going all the way up to the ceiling. So that's really nice. Over behind this door is going to be the water closet. So you have a nice private water closet. And for the regular closet, we're right around here. So follow me this direction and we go into our regular closet. So this is something that I would do. I would just put some nice custom cabinets in here or custom closet. Um, and then you have everything you need for this house. So let's go ahead and go back to the front of the house and show you what we have there. Now, if you're looking for more information about the HOA here or lot premiums or upgrades, make sure you give me a call or contact me at 407-487-3030. Those prices do change and vary from time to time. So I'll get you the latest updated pricing on all those items. So let's go ahead to the front of the house and show you bedroom number two. 
get you a good view of what you see when you come into the house. So here's bedroom two. We have the queen size bed, a couple end tables on your side, accent wall with light fixtures, you know, highlighting the different pictures on the wall. We have crown molding around, a couple windows looking out onto the front of the house. This one does have a closet. So if I come over here, you can see we have the sliding doors for the closet behind there, sort of your tip, uh, typical cl uh, closet for about a 1,968 square foot house. This is just a luxury version of a smaller house. So as we come around here to our right, we have the cabinets in that like light beige color, solid surface countertops, mirror going all the way up to the ceiling with a light fixture coming out toilet and this one does have a tub the tub does have the tile going all the way up to the ceiling with the accent tile coming down in the middle and window for some natural light behind this door is going to just be a towel closet but let's go ahead and go next door which is the flex space so it's currently set up like a little office with a desk here tv on the far side with a bunch of accent walls uh, we have the crown molding going around on the ceiling on the other side this really nice custom cabinet with the uh, cabinets with the light underneath and the floating shelves going all the way up to the ceiling really nice contrast with the grays and the blues now there's a bunch of different options you can do here so let's talk about that this could be uh, separated with a door so if you want it to be an office or fitness room you can put a double door right here and that's got, got you covered another option you can have you can take the flex space and bedroom two, you can combine it into one and become a secondary owner suite. So a nice big bedroom with a bathroom. Uh, the other option you can do is an in-law suite. And an in-law suite, what that will do is it will close this whole section off again. And this would be a bedroom. And there'll be a door going into a separate living room with a door coming into the main house right around there. So those are different structural upgrades you can do with this specific home. Another thing you can do, well, let's go ahead and show you the laundry room first. Behind this door is the air handler, and then we come into the laundry room, and the laundry room has this funky tile. We see this a lot in modern houses now, in the laundry room, where they do the laundry room with all this sort of different shapes on the tile with the different grays and whites. We have our washer, our dryer, and the built-in cabinets and sink. Now, the other option you can do this, if you need some extra square footage, you can move this door back. Now, this goes to the two-car garage. It's currently locked, so we can't go in there, but this door and everything moves about the space of stairs and then there's the stairs that go up to a bonus suite that will be above us that bonus suite will be about 18 feet by 12 feet so it gives you a little extra square footage so if you want that they can do that for you too so let's go ahead and check out the outdoor living area all right so welcome to the outdoor living area we have the sliding glass door that opens up it's a triple slider but it goes through and you can have the indoor and the outdoor living area together um, the first thing I see is we do have a covered patio area, pavers on the floor, living area on this side, and then on this side we have a little dining area. Now there is an option where you can extend the primary suite and the covered patio four feet off of here, and you can even put a cabana bathroom here. So if you want that half bath out here, that's an option for you also. But what's really nice is we continue the pavers, and these are all of course upgrades out here to this really, really long pool. You can easily do laps back and forth, back and forth with the affinity edge on the back side. We have a jacuzzi in front of us that can fit probably about eight people in it. So a really nice size jacuzzi. So in the winter time, if you want that warm water, you have that option. But most of the time we're going to have days like today where it's nice and beautiful and hot that you can be in the regular pool. And then of course, all the tropical landscaping all around us and the view of the golf course behind us. So if you want more information about this home, make sure you give us a call again. My name is Mike. My phone number is 407-487-3030. I want to thank you all for watching. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye.